Conditions temporarily closed the cafeteria today at Ben Davis High School. Inspectors found nearly a dozen mouse droppings in the kitchen area. Tonight at 5, our Jenny Runovich shows us how this inspection process works for schools and why a closure is not common. Well, it's actually pretty rare, but the number of mouse droppings found in that cafeteria found in this inspection report forced extreme measures to keep kids safe and school leaders are actually OK with that. This is not the kind of report card you want for your child's school cafeteria. Multiple critical violations from mice. Health inspectors made the discovery Monday at Ben Davis after someone called in a complaint. Then they closed the cafeteria. For schools, it's pretty rare that we would do that. It was the amount of droppings. It was just the areas not being um, monitored as heavily as we would like and not having the documentation we would need to know that we felt safe walking away from that without some limitation of food service. Violations describe mice droppings in eight areas of the kitchen, in a cooler, under a sink, behind cooking equipment. Hours after sanitizing, cleaning, calling out pest control, the school got a recheck and reopened for lunch. Inspectors will continue to monitor. We are grateful that somebody brought this to our attention. School leaders say this is actually a good lesson in see something, say something. In Marion County, like restaurants, schools get a food safety inspection twice a year. Complaints catch issues in between. I know that when I go to a restaurant, I want to have that standard upheld. Uh, if I'm going to be sitting there and eating food, uh, and we certainly expect to be held to that same standard. I would say that if parents have their kids tell them that they're concerned or see something, then please let us know because this came from a consumer complaint and we really value those to make sure that we can get in um, when there is a concern because we can only be in there so many times a year and if they're there every day, they're going to see things we don't. Just like restaurants, food safety reports for schools are publicly available so you can look up your own child's school and see the reports for yourself. We've made it easy for you with a link on WTHR.com.